Um, my name is Will Horniff, and I have been coming to the Emergence Multi Site for two years. I found out about it through my sister Vanessa. Um, one day she just told me about this great church that I wanted to uh, take a look at. Well, when I first showed up, I uh, it, it was interesting because I noticed it was a lot different from the traditional church services that I did, attended growing up. And um, I love the fact that the Bible was taught uh, expositionally, that we went through verse by verse, chapter by chapter, line by line, and that I really felt that I really connected with the praise and the worship, I connected with the message, and you know, everywhere I looked, there was just people of different ages and it was just really great to to see just you know my life I grew up in the church so I, I was saved I don't even remember the age basically but I have to say that for the majority of my life my salvation wasn't consistently worked out in my actions it wasn't something that I necessarily lived by and um, you know when I was young I, I started acting I started I had success from the age of 12 starting with a film called The Sandlot to crazy other films like Born to be Wild and the list goes on um, and you know I always grew up with the idea of yeah of course Jesus Christ is my Savior of course he died for my sins you know, of course yeah that's just that's just natural I, yeah of course I'm saved but I don't really think the gospel really transformed my life in a way that it, it fed through to my daily actions and to be quite honest what happened for the majority of my life is I would erect idols. You know, when I was younger, uh, the idol was acting. You know, I was good at it. I had success in it. So well, I just did it. And that was my idol. And a lot of my prayer life, because well, God is sovereign, I mean, where He's God, would be God, get me this. God, get me that. God, have this prosper my idol, prosper my plans. You know, I'm a married. I'm married. I've been married for two years. Uh, my wife and I, uh, we've known each other for five years. We've been dating for five years. And you know, it, goes to, it goes without saying, she's like the best thing in the entire world, the best gift that God's ever given me. And so, as a husband, I want to be able to provide security. I want to be able to provide you know, financial stability for my wife. And the, what God did in my life is basically, he said, you know that acting thing? Yeah, we're going to kind of slam that door shut for the moment. Um, we're going we're gonna to have you do something else. So I have another job that I do right now, but I, I've been given the opportunity for a very lucrative uh, position um, in, a, in another field. And it came to a position, a point in my life where I had to say, well, are you going to take this? Are you going to take this stability, security for the rest of your life? I mean, this job was amazing. Um, or are you going to go do what I have kind of told you that you're supposed to do ever since you're young? And I've known ever since I was young that I was supposed to be involved in ministry. And so I kind of came to that crossroad in my life. And I prayed a lot about it, spent a lot of time in prayer, a lot of different counsel, talking to different people. And I decided, you know what, give it up. Give up the security. Give up an idol of security. Give up an idol of financial stability, an idol of control. And just put it out all on the line for God. You know, so for me, one of the things that I'm most excited and passionate about is that part of uh, emergence in Jacksonville Chapel's mission is the spread of the gospel through, through North Jersey, an area where less than 5% of the population really goes to gospel-centered, gospel-believing churches. And one of the areas of that is church planting. And personally, uh, since I'm going into ministry, that is one of the areas that I'm most excited about to see what God's going to do through that and where God's going to lead me and my wife in that area of church planning. So I personally just want to thank everyone at Jacksonville Chapel for allowing something like Emergence to exist. Personally, I can't imagine where I'd be if Emergence had been a part of my life for these last two years. God has used it to radically change the course, the direction of my life, and my eternal destiny here. And I'm really excited. I am so passionate about what has been happening through Emergence, and I'm so grateful to be a part of it and the leaders and the people that I've developed amazing relationships with. Thank you so much.